Okay, family, so like we talked on our last video, okay, we're going to talk about the entry. So let me let me take this off. Okay, so let's talk about entry. Entry. We want to look to entry. Entry. Okay. How I get into the market, okay? This moment, okay, PJ, this moment is great. By the way, welcome back. <laughs> welcome back to our channel, Verica Investment Group. Welcome, it's your boy PJ here. Uh, thank you for being part of the um, Verica Investment Group, the big money group. And also, uh, you know, like I always say, subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. Give us a like. Please to the video, you know, let's help the community how to do swing trading when the smart money comes in. Okay, so today, everything I'm explaining here, everything you see in the, in the screen right now, also you can apply in the low in the low time frames. You can, you can apply in 15 minutes, you can apply in one minute, you can apply in five minutes, three minutes, 30 minutes, one hour, four hours. I do four hours because I'm a swing trader. Also, I don't swim because I, I, I'm busy. I'm busy. Okay, so every single time that I that I that I look for trade, you know, every single candle is is four hours. So we talk about four hours. But at five p.m., that's the first candle start for the next trading day. Five p.m. Then nine p.m. Then one a.m. You got three six candles. Okay, so one a.m. Then four a.m. Okay, or so five, five, five a.m. Yeah, five a.m. Then nine a.m. again, and then uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's put it like that. Okay, the first candle start at five p.m. Close at nine. So there you go. That's the first candle. Nine p.m. One a.m. Five a.m. Nine a.m. 1 p.m. and then close at 5 p.m. So you got six candles for the red for one day of trading in four hours. I'm talking about four hours. So like I said, it's your boy PJ from Better Account Investment Group. So today we're going to talk about entries. What to look when I'm getting into the market. We're going to talk about what we're going to talk about. We're going to talk about auto blocks. We're going to talk about OB, okay? We're going to talk about per value gap. We're going to talk about uh, what else? Um, candles. Or like that kind of stick. I don't know how to draw it. Stick, sticks. Kind of sticks pattern. Pat, pattern. There you go. Those three. Okay, we're going to talk about this. OB. What to look in OB? Well, that OB, the OB need to have a fair value gap. Okay? The OB need to have a fair value gap with it. That's the best OB that I'm being trading that I'm going to show to you. Also, when this, the price comes to that specific OB, when the fair value gap, wait for the candle stick pattern. Okay, wait for that. I'm going to show you in the chart. Don't worry. I'm going to show you in the chart. It's going to be a quick video. And I'm going to show you a couple of entries that I have too. Okay, and then remember the next video is going to be risk management. How to calculate your, your, your risk in the market and also how to protect your money in the market. Okay, that we talk about managing trading. We don't want to talk about the next video about that. That will be Friday. Okay, so uh, OB entries. OB, that's mean point interest. We talk about POI, point of interest. And per value gap, and then there you wait for the candlestick pattern to form, and then you get into the trade when the next video, proper risk management. So family, let's go straight to that. Uh, remember, I am not a financial fi fi financial advisor. Okay, let's go like that. 
I trade paper trading. You can see it's paper, paper trading right here. Okay, all my videos you see I'm doing demo. So, you know. So if you not uh every single money, Forex market is too risky. Please, if you're gonna put money, real money, put money like you don't use for mortgage, rent, uh any uh food, grocery, nothing for your family, please. Separate a little money and then growing, growing, growing. That's the way you're gonna be putting money for trading. Okay, I I told straight to my people. Hey, when you want to uh, every single money you put in the market uh, to trade, remember you lose the money. Simple as it is. Don't 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 count on that money now. Okay, so let's go straight. Let's go do. Uh, let's go talk about that. So, but right here. Let's talk about here. I want to tell you. I want to tell you first about what I'm waiting. What I'm waiting. Well, here you can see it. Uh, the market already closed below here. Okay. Here. So right there, we got what? We got what? After the balls being breaking, we got uh change your character for sale. Okay, change your character for sale. So what we waiting here? We waiting simple. We waiting for the market to come up and trade, and also uh give me a a, a nice uh retracement to one of the point interest. Which one point interest? So this is the OB. This candle is the last candle. See, this is the last candle, and then we was the one break make the break the structure. This candle let me put a little close. Then you can see it. This candle is the last candle, okay? Then you got one bull, uh, bearish, 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 boom, two big bearish. That was a one at 1 p.m., 1 a.m., so at 1 a.m., the four hours, and then a five, you got that one at 5 a.m., okay? This one is the 9 a.m. So what are we waiting? We're going to wait. We already sell market. Change it, change it character. So right here. We're gonna do this. I want to put our point of interest sell in the market. Why? So we talk about. So let's go like that. What we say about the entries? Hold on. Sorry. And the entry will look for what? Come on, buddy. Okay, cool. And then you're looking for OB that has a fair value gap. Okay, so let's talk about this OB. This OB, one, two, three, where's the value, the fair value gap? It's right here, family. What is the fair, what is the fair value gap? If you don't know what is fair value gap, simple family. In YouTube, you find so many videos about that. So many, so many. But fair value gap is simple. When you see one candle, this candle, and three candles, like this candle and this candle, and the week, never touch the week of this one. Of the... Right here. See, this week, this candle closed here, then this one came boom. This one went a little bit, but it didn't cover the week right here. So that's why it didn't close that gap. So that's mean that's fair value gap. So what we're going to do, we're going to put this and this, and that is our fair value gap for the trade. Okay. So we put it right here. That's why I love trading view, fam. I love trading view because I got everything set up. So what I'm expecting now, I'm expecting, I'm expecting, I am expecting the market to come and this way touch here and drop. That's exactly I'm not gonna like I'm just gonna do this. That's exactly what I'm expecting. Okay. I'm gonna show you a couple of entries. Let me see if this pair I found the entries. So let's say the market was coming down boom 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 three times kind of rule one two three it didn't break okay boom let me see didn't break so if it didn't break here is what change your character 
okay? There's a target for my eye right there. And then the market didn't came to this break of break of our block. This is a break on the block, and then it came. So we're gonna straight go up. Let's look for the pullback. You know this one I'm looking at. Let, let, let me let me put it over here. Hold on. Let's say the market is here right now. I'm going to show you the end. Let's see you see it. We got one pullback. One. Two. Okay, one candle, two candles. Yes. So I'm going to hear that was another change of character. Why did I say change your character? Anyway, yeah, let's go like that. Yeah, change your character. Or seven. That's what I look. So what was the high point? The high point was there. This one. Okay, the high point for that change your character was there. Boom. So let's see. Where is the third value gap here? It was... So we got this one here, but it's already covered. You see, it's already covered. So let's see the market reaction. Boom. I'm looking for the right entry. Give me a second. <clears throat> this market was a little, com a little complicated. So then here again, you got fur value guy again here. Okay. Not fur value guy, buy shop again. Okay, so the market went up, 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 one, two, three. No, that's one, two only. Okay, the market is so oh, cool, cool. Okay, you got one candle, no one break, it came. Okay, look here. Look here. Let's see, this is the order block, okay? This is the order block to buy. Okay, the block. Right here, you got the fair value gap. Okay? So you got two options. You got two options to jump in the fur value that right here. That was a good decision. This is a candle. Uh, okay, cool. There you go. I got something here for you. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. So this is the fur value got here. Okay, this is the auto block. Remember the auto block right here is it one candle? Let's see. There is if you and and, and the boss. I right? boss buy. Is the the all the last bearish candles that produce the gap, the gap? What you mean? I'll explain to you. Top of, look at this candle. Who should want to break the structure? This candle. Okay, this candle break the structure. Boom. Look at the fair value gap. This candle, the weak trade here, closed over there. This one came and just stay right there. That's completely. It, it was a fair value gap. So for me, that's a great candle for trade. You got two options of getting into the fair value gap or getting into the order block. So this one, you got 32 pips. Normally I'm going for what? For three. Let's see if we get it. If we don't get it, we protect it. When we get 1%, we protect the market. There you go. 1% we protect, okay? We protect and one percent. Let's see. We protect the one percent. Let's see. We went in a little bit. We went in a little bit. Okay. We need a little bit. Okay. Touch the other block. You see right here. Touch the other block. Okay. So look, 
You got two entries here. Remember, this, this boss is in a game. I got two entries, two different entries. Two different Even I can get this for the for the this this is the candlesticks banner. This is in addition. This candle. This candle is in the candle. See, we the the February guy, you can jump in it, no problem. And this one, no, that one is part of the rules, but this one, boom. But then if you you, you miss that trade, then what we do, you come here and look at that and go for candles. 244. You go for candles right there. See that? So that when this this that was a 1 a.m. So this is 5. So at 4 a.m. If you wake up for London, you that's your trade right there. Then you put your then you put your on below the Below the the old block, and then you go one to three. That one went only one to one. So let's say my take profit it was protected already when three hundred whatever, and then um, okay, you got it. So your take profit it was protected already. Wait, 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 wait. Right there. Protect the trade, my man. Okay. That is there. Now protect it. Okay, cool, cool. There you go. So that was a trade. That was literally with the trade. When was that trade happening? That was Monday. No, that was Tuesday. Okay, I didn't wake up on that one. So that, right there. So London was 4 5. When 4 45, you wake up. When, when is the timing for my trade? Okay, when is the timing for my trade? It's London. 4.30 a.m., I wake up 4.30 a.m. If I don't want to do London, I wait for 9 a.m. New York, okay? 9 a.m. New York, 4.30 a.m. New York. New York time, okay? New York time. But 4.30 a.m. is London session. So right here, that's my trade. It's like that. I got my, that's the trade. That's the trade. That's the trade. Boom, I got breakout. No, that's bullshit. <laughs> Oh, shit. I, I, I put it. I put a break in. So you got it. That's the way it is. That's the way it is. So you got it. So that was my entry right there, and that was my risky entry, and this is my secure entry. So go be candles, and go be candles right there. What is this? Go be candles. Simple. And go for candle is when a bearish candle, a bullish candle, and go the body, not the week. Don't put the week. It's more secure if you if the, the body and go for the week right here. But it, it didn't. But I focus in the body. That's the way I'm doing it. I'm focusing on the body, body to body. Okay, body to body. That's the way it is. And like I say, it's more secure if the body of the bear of the bullish candle and go. The week two, okay. I'm gonna look for one, one like that. Let me, let me show you. Let me show you. So right here, you see that? Right here, you gotta go for candle. This bullish candle engulf this bearish candle. It, it, it engulf in the whole thing. You see, we break right here. The price stop right there. So engulf in the whole thing. Let me look for another one. This one is engulf the candle too. Look at this one. That's the one of the most beautiful one. And go for candle here too. Bears and go for candle right here. You see that one? That was a beautiful one. Then boom. You see? Close below the week right here. Boom. That's a beautiful one too. This one also was a it was a beautiful one. Boom. You see? There's another one. This one is a beautiful one too. So you can see the pattern what I'm looking at. 
it's a golden candle or uh, hammer. I look for every single pattern. I like a rejection from the song. And that's like what, what I did. See right here? That was a nice rejection. Boom. One to one. Boom. I got a uh, break even. Off. Boom. That's it. Okay? So that's the way you, you entry in the market. It was a simple video, family. Simple. Then in every single video you're going to see in every single session that I do, you want to see why I get into this trade. Even in, look, I got a couple of trades here. I don't show you why I get into those trades. Let me show this. Let me see, I'm waiting almost the same setup in both of them. USB, 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 in, in, in USB, 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 I'm waiting for the same setup. Number right here, why I get into this trade? Well, I can tell you. The first thing we talk about is what? Order block, right here. The, that order block has a gap? Yes, look at this. Beautiful gap, you see? Beautiful gap. Then the micro key here, boom. I'm not getting in that candle. I'm not getting in this one, not even this one, not even this one, not even this one. Not even this one. When I saw this one, and go for it. all of those movement. I say, man, the market will go up. Boom. And I get in here. That was a one, one, one p.m. That one. I get in at one p.m. Sometimes I got a little break in my business. So I get in at one p.m. right there. You see? That, that, that one was not engulfing candle, but I sometimes I do I do like a rally for two candles and go in the whole movement. One, two. <clears throat> I get in here, put my soul below the the week. Sometimes sometimes the, 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 the market weak weak the 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 order block. So I put my soul below the week and then I waited for the movement. So now I'm waiting for one hour or something to this market close right here. If this market, if this candle doesn't close when the movement on top of that, that means that market will continue reversing down. That is a USD candle. Okay. So if the market, this candle. We have none of this. It doesn't close on top of that structure, mm -hmm. or at least doesn't close like strong like this. Don't let it, like a, a big long week in the top. That means the margin of your trace is for sure. You're gonna do it. Okay, so let's continue with another one. I got the goal here. The goal. Remember, I told you in the last video, the goal probably can't reverse. The news came and helped him out. Let me put a break even already. Let me put a break even right here. Okay. Let me put a break even right here. Okay. I'm already break even go. So, um, uh, right here is a very good point of interest for selling gold. Why I sold there? Simple. You see it right here. I'll show you. This is the Gophie candle. You see the Gophie candle? But why I don't see any order block there? Well, you don't see it, but in one hour, yes. Now you see it? Right here. You see it? Big value gap. You see one. Look, one, two, and three. You see one, two, and three. Where's the value gap? Right here. See this week? So this week. So this is a great order block for sale. It sell here. Look at this. That was a beautiful sell right here when they go for candle. Boom, you sell it when this candle close at 10, 10 a.m. Sell it. You put the stall also in the top of the in the top of the other block. Then the market going like this. Boom, 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 boom. So let's say you do the right sell. I get in four hours now, but I get in there. Let's say the market is this is the sell. Okay. And it's the lows.
this goes right here. So 130, 131 pips to win. 192. Okay, so that's a train for the goal. You see the, the, the date. So sometimes go oh, when I see a uh, crazy move and 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 uh, look at what I do, family. It's simple. When I see the market stop, like normally I have to continue to wear my first bet, my, my order block. My order block is right here for a while. You see it right there on the first value gap. See? Three candle, first value gap, boom. And I see the market stop here, and then went back up and stop here. I said, hold on, something happened right here. Let me go to one hour. And that's exactly what I did. And then one hour, we got one with a block right here. The market stopped there. And that's why the market's shooting down right now. Okay? So what I'm expecting, I'm expecting the market between now and tomorrow to break that low. If it doesn't break that low, mm, the market could probably can't return. But it doesn't matter. I already secured my money right there. The store will break even, so I don't care for the market come back again. I don't care. The market come back again, I'm going to from here. The market doesn't stop there. What I do is send. I just break for the high. They break the high, I'm waiting for buy. Simple, man. That's the way you have to do. And the crazy thing is, in every single time frame, you can do this. For me, like I say, I do in this time frame because for me, it's four hours. I don't know. Focus on my things, and then when I'm calling at 4, 4 30 a.m., I'm going to look for a trade. Let me see if I find a trade. No, nah, okay, but then I wait for nine. Simple as it is, family. So I got this trade. I got this trade. I got this trade. I'm waiting for that one. I'm waiting for this one. No, I got this trade here too. Why are you getting this one? Tell me why. Well, the market came here to this auto block right in. See the auto block right here. The market came here, boom. The trade went there, it didn't break the high, it came back. And why are you getting into the market? Let me tell you why. I get in because so all those rejection and the same song, boom, 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 boom. Let me take that trade right here. I took a little longer right there. That was a 1 a.m. 1 p.m. again. Yesterday, I put 79 pips in the loss, and I'm going to win three to one. That's why I get into the market. Why are you buying? The market's going like doing a low, low here. That is a low high. That is a low, low. That is a low, low. That is a low high. Yeah, but it's not break my point yet. My swing, you see right here. That's why I'm still I'm still buying this market. I'm still buying since they don't break not this right here. I'm still buying the NCDJ well. Simple, not the next. That's right. That's why you need to be. You watch the next video, the risk management management. Because this one, you can learn why I do that. Okay, so NCD cap, I'm waiting for the go back there. And when it's NCD USD, GBP MC, I'm waiting for the pullback. Uh, GBP RT2, now try to break the low, but if it didn't, GBP JPY, hopefully he's doing it. Then I can go selling GBP JPY and selling USD JPY. This is a beautiful uh, GBP cap, I'm still. Profit, so let me lock a little more. Profit, lock a little more. Like I say, if this candle right here, it didn't close, I have to close over there. If it closes over there, I'm secure. If it just let the weekend doesn't close on top of the swing, mm -hmm. I'm gonna be selling right there. Not selling, I want to close the trade. I already got a trade protector, so it don't matter. Little GBP check, same thing, waiting for the pullback. Driven with GBP USD, I told you in the last video, it's going to go all the way. If this 
this one it was uh, uh, auto block. You got a break right here. Okay. You got a break right here. But why are you going to pull here a change of character? Well, I cannot put a change of character because of my swing points over there. You see? So let's, let's do it like that. 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 The disc swing point right here. Yeah, break from where? That was the one that I point. Right here, that was my point. Boom, boom, boom. It didn't break. When you back up, boom. Here would break. After this one, which was the high point? It was this one? Or it was this one? Because this one, all this, it was the same moment. All this, all this. This is the same moment. Part of this, this high. So the more high point is this one. So be secure, I want this high, sweet high to be break. If it's break, then I'm buying. Here, the market can go and break this one. For me, that's liquidity right there. So the market going to top cheap, then we're going to trade them from there. The same thing happened when the euro you were in. Right here. We threw prop in this one and you were asking. Where's the entries? The entries, I did it when this is big, big candle. But normally, if you want to see the entries right here, this one right here, that was a break, break, uh, breakout entries. Uh, but uh, the other block is this one right here. This one. So now I'm getting in and the fair value gap. If you show me where the fair value gap, well, I'm going to show it to you. Don't worry, I'm going to. Let's say the market is here. I'm waiting. Okay. Let me take off the feed. The market is here. This is the order block right here. For sale. Where is my third guy? It's right here. Between this and this. This is my third guy. For seven. You got it? So when I look at this movement crazy, okay, I got two options. Wait for the price to come to where? To the the flower or the block, or I'll wait for the price to come to the fair value. Remember, it's based on your risk, whatever you want. So let's, let's take these off. And then let's say I'm waiting. We already got touch right here. This is touch and rejection, but I didn't okay. My entry, like I told you, my entry is of what? In London session, when it got to 5 p.m., 5 a.m. or 9 a.m. in New York. Let's put it right here. What time it is? 21. That's 5 p.m. 1 p.m. 1 a.m. Hmm. Okay. So I'm like again, boom, boom, the retracing. I can get in here if I want to. Why? Well, the market break. See the market break, boom, close. This candle didn't touch it. This is go great. Touch the fair value gap, touch it, gotta touch it. So I put it right here. That's my entry. No, hold on. What are you doing? So I can get in here if I want to. Put the stall over there, 48. I'm going one to one. Uh, hold on, sorry. One to three. What I do, do quickly, I don't, I don't, I don't, worry, I don't waste my time. I just do 48 time calculator. Let me see. Calculator, calculator. Come on. I do 48 times three. 100, 144. Why I put the zero? Because you have to all the time. Oh, let me. Four AA time three. Oh, yes. Six, four, six, four. That one. 
stay here. I want two, but there you go. You want three right there. That's a tray, right? So you can either forget it, set it, and forget it. Simple. You set it, forget it, you sell the margin right there. And that's all you have to do. Nothing else. Yes. Sell there. For the still loss. Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry, sorry. Let's do it. Let's do it right. Remember, like I said, your entries will be nine a.m. or five a.m. Candles. You have to wake up at four thirty a.m. Got one, I am. Okay, this is a 5 p.m. Okay, 9 a.m. Close here. Okay, I got the entries. Boom. Don't complicate yourself. I mean, this mark is already complicated. This mark is already complicated. There you go. Let's say you print the trade. It doesn't matter how long, how long it will take. Who cares? You got it? It doesn't matter how long it takes. You can let the market go. Protect your trade. When you when you profit, protect your trade. Let me see if it is a one to one. Normally I protect the one to one. Let me see if it's a one to one. Am I in my MP4? I do it. Uh -huh. It is only one to seventy three. So you guys, that's a trade. Simple today, family. If the market decides to go up, well, we look, we're looking for the for the swing trade. See, on the swing trade right there. Where is the swing trade? Right there. Yeah, it's right there. That's the swing point right there. If the market close above of this, completely, I'm looking for buy. Okay, your MCD boom. Boom, nothing. Nothing. Same consolidation. Nothing. Nothing. Okay, I'm waiting there. I'm waiting for the market to come. Uh, let me see. I got the fair value gap here. For about the guys here. There you go. So what I'm waiting is a market that froze to this right here. That's like what I'm waiting. Euro Aussie. Why I get into Euro Aussie? Well, you already know. You already know. What I saw is simple. I saw this and go be can right here, but I saw a little. So the real entries in this position. Where is the real entry? Let's find out. Well, let me look. Hold on. Let's 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 five. Remember five five a.m. nine a.m. So the market came here. Boom 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 boom. But kind of this one. That's a one one a.m. Okay, this is a five a.m. Did this thing go for candle? No, it's not. What about this nine a.m.? No, this is a big big candle. It's not gonna go for. So boom 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 boom. Okay, that's that's a five p.m. This is a nine p.m. I think it, I get in and down like yesterday. I did. <laughs> when this is going for candles, that's exactly what I get in there. But look, the market came here. Boom, boom, boom. One, five, a.m., nine, a.m. So let's go like that. Simple. This is the entry. Put the stalls over here. Okay.
96 pips. Who cares? So you put 960, 960, find 3. 280, 288 pips. Okay? So that's where I am right now in this trade. I'm waiting for the market to shoot up. To the, to the high. You continue to hide to this place. When are you going to be there? I don't know. When are you, when you go? Okay. So, uh, you are USD. USD. I'm waiting for what? Look at this. I'm waiting for what? Look at this. You already know. 42 minutes. I'm waiting for what? Let's kind of close and go for the body. I'm going to sell your USD for sure. And paper trading, okay? Paper trading, you got it? Paper trading. <laughs> Let's go on this one. I'm waiting to touch it. Not touch it yet. KJBY, I'm waiting for what? Hold on. Where does this mean? See, sometimes I got stuff and I don't. No, 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 man. Where is it? Where's my OB here? What I'm waiting. Where is my OB? You can tell me. Let's look at the OB. I'm gonna show you how to look at the OB. This one is right here. Where's the OB? When the fur value gap. And look, this candle right here. Yeah, this one has a fur value gap. So we talk about this. All the whole bunch of candle right here. Let's see this. All right, so I got two. So I got this here. Okay, or I got this one. If you want to be ready for everything, you just call me out the whole thing. That's it. You see? Call me the whole thing. You can just, you can be called everything. By the end of the day, the flow is going to be below. <laughs> call me the whole thing, and that's it. See? So the buyer has to come in this song. That's it. The song is going to be there anyway. So if you put this, you put it right here, you. How much is going to be the stall right here? 80. 82, 30. 32, 30. 823. 823 times 3. 2469. 2469. Boom. That's it. That's the trade. You wait for this. You got it? I did, man. I do a weekly analysis here. <laughs> <laughs> look, at this trade. look at this beautiful trade right here. You see it? The market, the market change of character here. Boom, 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 boom. But hold on, PJ. This is not a change. Where is the beautiful? Uh, I don't see a fair value gap here. Where it is? Oh my God. Well, you're right. I don't see it either. Right there, I don't see it. Where it is? I see it here. I can see here. So if you have a little trade, what I do? Simple. Remember, I'm protecting the low all the time. All this is my all this is my all this is my this is my this 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 mark is messy. I don't see it. I don't see it, but what I saw, what was when the market got break right here, they change the character. You see, the swing point it was here. Well, hold on. Yeah, right there.
So the stream pulling that break there. We got so is it a pullback? Look at this one, two, three. So I expect this one to go and what? Boom and break. It didn't. It didn't break. So the market went what? Okay. It didn't break. So the market went pull back, boom, 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 break the structure. Okay. Break the structure here. And I said, okay, where is my last? Where's my last point here? Where it was? Look at this right here, the answer. See the answer right there? Engulfing candle. Body, body, engulfing. Another entry right here, same song. See, same song, another entry. Another entry. You got like three entries in the same song. Look at this here. Look at this. One entry. This one. And when this, I'm already, I'm already done. I'm gonna check in this little bit. See one entry, five entry, another one. Another one. We got so many. And another one. Four entries. Same song. You got it? Four entries in the same song. Boom, 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 boom. And then the market went shoot up. Three to one. Let me show, let me show you. Three to one. And I'm going to do like a, the four inches, right? I'm going to on this one. I'll put it on this last one. Okay, I'm going to trade boom. The lows where? Below this time. Sixty five, sixty five, six, six, five, six, nine, three, equal nineteen sixty eight, nineteen, nineteen sixty eight. Okay. The market did went big. I did. Might just stay there. <laughs> That's it. The market did went big. Okay. So let's put a break even to that one. Seven. Or well, sometimes when you see this, okay, let me go there, boom, you close. That's we talk about managing trading. That's gonna be your next, your next, your next video. Look at that. Okay, next video. That one I get in, that's a breaking structure. Okay, it's breaking structure. This kind of break, I get in there. That's another way to get into the market. So if I'm really with that, I leave you with that. Okay. So thank you for having us. Thank you for being part of the Better Kind Investment Group, the Big Money Group. Uh, also remember one thing only: the sky is the limit, and never, never, never in your life stop dreaming. Okay. Always dream. Uh, another thing: um, please, 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 please continue sharing this video with other people. And like I say, if you're not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you. God bless. See you in the next video. It's going to be about risk management. Peace.